Ultimate Ultimate Armors here, just Jason, Brian Sensor Gene Gunner. Just wanted to make this video myself because it's something that I made myself, ran no part in this. It's a custom build, but it's a nerf duct tape holster for my nerf and strike each disruptor. And it fits really well. It's got um, ammo holder, six hold six darts because my disruptor is a six shooter. Um yeah, I mean, it's, it actually fits really well. You'd be surprised. You know? Sorry about that. So, fix my camera. Um, so, basically what I did was, I got a sheet of paper. Um, got a roll of duct tape. Um, duct taped both sides of the paper. Folded the paper around like, like this. Just I folded it. Um, hold on, let me get some paper. I duct taped a full piece of paper. Then I just folded it like this around my disruptor and everything. Um, Ryan's, I made Ryan one, but for some reason his took uh, one and a half pieces of paper. I don't know. It doesn't look as good as mine, just because it's a little bigger. But his does fit his Maverick, and mine will not fit my Maverick. But yeah, I just folded duct tape it, folded a piece of paper, duct taped it together. Um, this right here, it's a belt loop only. So if you have a belt or a bandolier or something, you can wear it on your hip. It's not a drop leg, but I am working on a drop leg holster, which shouldn't be too hard. So I just got a little bit of some paper, duct taped both sides again, folded it over, made the belt loop right here, then got some duct tape, duct taped the belt loop down and now it's actually pretty sturdy now for the ammo holders which um if you can tell by the name hold nerf darts hold on let's see if i can do this in as you can see it doesn't fall out so it actually holds in there pretty sturdy and does not damage the darts but i do not recommend leaving them inside the ammo holder just in case like if you're storing it for a while it could crush the darts but leaving it in there for like a game for maybe like a few hours it's not going to damage the darts like some 3d printed models but yeah it's actually a really good build you don't need a bottom because the handle restricts it from going all the way in like the nerf holster because the nerf holster is absolute trash but this is a review sort of a very review of my holster I will be doing a tutorial video on how to make it I just wanted to show you the holster and here's what it looks so like. so here's what the holster looks like I'm sorry about the cross shot I don't like it more than you like it so whatever but and I'm wearing I'm wearing Adidas sweatpants so there's no belt loops it looks a little dorky but this is just for demo as you can see it's pretty snug and to, to draw it without pulling it up like this, you just hold it. Oops, the duct tape. Yeah. Leave it in there for a night or so, and it will loosen up a bit. Or just, like, draw with it and everything. You know, like, it's already feeling loose already. Then the ammo holder, if you're out of ammo, just grab some. Or if your gun's jammed or whatever, and you don't have time to get out your secondary, and I can just, like throw the dart at your enemy. And some of the game types that I play, it's legal to do that. Like when I play HPZ, if we don't have like sock bombs or whatever, I can like, I can just like throw a dart. I just built this so I haven't used it in the war, so I haven't really tested it in the war. But my birthday party on the 28th, sorry about that, the battery's almost dead, I need to charge my camera. Um, but my birthday party on the 28th, I'm inviting some of my friends. Um, and so my brother and I are gonna actually try out our new holsters. But, and if you wanna, you can do the same build with a hammer shot. Just you might wanna maybe put some cardboard or something at the bottom so it doesn't fall out because the hammer shot is really a lot smaller than this. But this is one of my favorite secondaries so I just wanted to make it voted. Um, holster for it. But, yeah. 
how I actually made the ammo holder was I got some duct tape, made a little, I rolled it, I folded the duct tape over, made, rounded, rounded it, like folded it into like a little cylinder, put the dart inside there, and um, I duct taped the bottom so the darts wouldn't fall out, even though there's a slim chance of it falling out. Um, sometimes they will get, like this one right here is just a flop, but yeah, that's how you basically, that's how, that's how you, that's how I made my holster, I'll be doing a tutorial on the ammo holder separately than the holster, so that'll be a long video, but it's going to be time lapse for the holster, but still enough time lapse that you can see how I'm actually doing it, so yeah, that's the review, like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'm saying this for Ryan, be a good person, and we will see you next time.